board and you we do I hear a motion to approve three certified recommendations for the 2019 2020 school year madam chair I, approve, I move that the board approve the three certified positions for the 2019 2020 school years recommended by dr. little and the senior leadership team okay, thank you dr. powers do I have a second second thank you miss green are there any questions or comments board regarding these three positions hearing none we'll take a vote all in favor please say aye Aye. Aye. Any opposed? The motion carries and it is unanimous. Uh, during executive session, uh, the board members received legal advice concerning a pending lawsuit in executive session. I want to remind everyone that board member Jada Garris has submitted a statement of recusal dated December 4th, 2018, thereby abstaining herself of all votes, deliberations, and other action on the following matter. Jada Garris individually and on behalf of all similarly, I cannot say that word, similarly situated versus Lexington County School District 1, case number 2017-CP-32-04435. The recusal states the reason for the disqualification is that Ms. Garris is a litigant in the above mentioned matter who possesses a financial interest, interest in its outcome. Therefore, Ms. Garris will not be present during this discussion in executive session and, and will not take part in this action. Board members, do I hear a motion regarding the discussion of the legal matter? Madam Chair, I move that the Board of Trustees decline to accept the settlement proposed presented to the board this evening by the plaintiff in the case of Garris versus Lexington 1. Okay, thank you, Dr. Powers. Do I have a second? Second. Thank you, Mr. Anderson. Are there any questions or comments regarding this motion, board? Hearing none, we'll take a vote. Remember, board, this is a motion to accept the declination of the proposal. Um, board members, uh, let's take a vote. All in favor of the motion as presented by Dr. Powers, please say aye. 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 Any opposed? The motion carries and it is unanimous. And I would like to uh, make a note for the minutes that there was ab one abstention, Ms. Layton. Property matters. Board members considered a property contractual matter related to a request from FBF Holdings, LLC. Do I hear a motion regarding this property contractual matter? Madam Chair, I move that the board authorize the administration to issue a quick claim deed to FBF Holdings, LLC, based on a boundary survey prepared by CEC Consulting, Engineering, Surveying, and Planning, dated September 1st, 2015, bearing job number 14068, recorded May 6, 2016, in the Lexington County Register of Deeds Office in Platte Book 18372 at page 293. Thank you, Ms. Green. Do I have a second? A second. Okay, thank you, Mr. Oswald. Okay, board, let's open this up for discussion. Um, Mr. Salters, would you just like to give us a little update on this? Because this is kind of a quick and something that kind of hit us kind of quick. So we need to understand a little bit better. Yes, Madam Chair, uh, members of the board, I direct your attention to the uh, screens. Uh, <clears throat> this is in reference to property that is adjacent to um, our existing River Bluff High School. Uh, on the left uh, over here, we have the um, River Bluff, the lower portion of the River Bluff High School property. Uh, you can see the red dot there, hopefully. Um, this is Corley Mill Road um, on the left side of the screen. Our property is on the east side of Corley Mill Road. Uh, we actually purchased two different tracts of land um, during that property purchase. This purchase is related, or this um, quick claim deed is related to the purchase uh, from ML South uh, Augusta LLC. Uh, and the property in question is across the street, which is displayed here on the right. Um, and there's a little pink triangle section here. Um, and in this map, this is the existing Corley Mill Road. Um, the lines here are the old Corley Mill Dirt Road. This plat actually goes back to 1950. Um, and so we were approached earlier this, uh, this past week um, when the owners of this property across the street from us were doing some uh, title research and came across this plat. Um, our property description uh, from our purchase uh, shows that we purchased 91.225 acres of land um, and is based on our boundary survey that was done at the time and references property east of Corley Mill Road. So in no way does our property purchase or closing documents or any deeds or anything like that show any ownership of any property 
west of Corley Mill Road. And so um, the um, owners of this property are asking us to issue a quick claim deed that basically says that we have no claim to any of this property um, on the west side of Corley Mill Road. And of course, all of our um, documents um, support that and, and I, would, I would support the recommendation to do that. Be happy to answer any questions that you have related to it. So no money exchanged hands for that pink section uh, on that map? No, Madam Chair. We, um, as I mentioned, we bought 91.225 acres of land um, which is all east of Corley Mill Road. Um, and so um, we, we paid for that and our, our property description um, specifies that 91.225 acres of land. Um, and so that was what our um, dollar figures were counted or calculated based on. And at no time did any of our property descriptions um, reference any property west of Corley Mill Road, which would be um, where this triangle of, of, of property is located. Any other questions, board? Comments? Uh, about two acres. About two acres of land. Mr. Oswald, that's, it's about two and a half acres, yes, sir, in, in the pink that, that appears to be in question. Yes, sir. Um, and what the, what the quick claim deed would do would be to say that we have no ownership or, or claim to any of that property in that, um, on, on the other side in that parcel. All of our properties on the east side. So we're quitting claim to something we never claimed? That is correct. That's awesome. <laughs> okay. Any other questions, That's board? Very Comments? well said. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, you've heard the motion from Ms. Green. Mr. Oswald seconded it. Let's take a vote. All in favor of this motion as proposed by Mr. Salters and his team, please say aye. 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 Any opposed? The motion carries, and it is unanimous.